Hey everyone, this is Justin Dicer, Taylor South Shore Marina. Today, gonna take you on a quick walk around of this 2023 Vexus VX21. The VX21 is the flagship of the Vexus bass boat line. This boat is 21 feet, 11 inches long. It's 97 inch beam. It has a 58 gallon fuel tank, and it has a ton of room for all of your gear and all your fishing stuff. Uh, here at the back side of the boat, you're gonna see this is a white summit with a black shadow and you have a racing red stripe here. Pop up cleats around the boat for tying off. Uh, since we're here on the outside of the boat, we'll check out the trailer. Vex has built all of their trailers in house. So this is a four inch C channel trailer, has road armor coating, has a full fiberglass fender, which is color matched to the pinstripe of the boat. You got 17 inch aluminum wheels with radial tires, disc brakes on both axles, all LED lit of course with backup lights and a parking brake as well. Here at the front of the trailer we have a three step uh, staircase with handrail coming up onto the bow of the boat. You've got your sling tongue of course which is standard and they even built in the seven way plug. So super nice trailer, going to get you to the lake no problem, I'm not going to ever have to worry about that at all. So. Here on the bow of the boat, we have the Minn Kota Altrex. This is the 112 iPilot trolling motor. We optioned the Victor dual bracket on this boat. So we already have our Solix 12 here at the back and you have room right here to mount a second unit, whether you're gonna do another Solix or a Garmin for Panoptics, whatever you would like to do there at the front. We're gonna hop over to the front of the boat now and check out the front deck. Up here on the front deck in the VX21, we have a port side rod box. This is all gonna be open, no tubes. It's got a shelf up here for laying rods here up on the top. Things that you'll notice that differ vexes from some other brands in the industry, our lids are complete fiberglass. They're like almost an inch thick, completely um, resin injected, molded for this particular spot. You've got V cut lids here in the front. This is always gonna push your rods when they're lined up here. When you open this up, it's gonna push them and they're just gonna fall right here into this track. You're never gonna throw one over the side. Just the engineers at Vex is designing that so you can't throw a rod over the side when you're fishing. But tons of room for rods. You can fit a ton of them in there. EVA floor lines so your reels and your rods aren't beating around on fiberglass. Compression, latches of course stainless steel striker plates so just in case somebody does that number like it everyone has seen it happen you don't mess up your fiberglass you got a huge built-up fiberglass lip with weather seal right here so you're going to keep rain out of this box there's no way no aluminum lids to sweat water into your box it's going to be completely dry and you can fit up to an eight foot 11 inch rod in this box here coming to the center this is where I keep all my tackle, but you got more rod tubes in here if you want to add extra rods. Uh, this will take an eight foot, four inch rod here in the middle, but tons of room for tackle, a tackle divider that's removable, all right here in the center lid. And this is EVA coated here from the Victor package, just gives our front deck a little extra pop. And then also this material dries very quickly, so it's a great spot to sit and retie. Storage over here. On the starboard side, right now we got the cover in this one and stuff. And then you've got a day box here on the VX21. This is an extra compartment here on this boat that the 20 won't have, um, but just a great spot again for more tackle or gear, whatever you want to put there. Headed back into the cockpit area, we have a nice step down here. This is going to have tool holders up top, and then you've got a pull out drawer down here at the bottom. So, a great spot for all of your dips and dyes and gloves, sunglasses. Coming around to the console, the VX21, you'll see we have a Hummingbird Solix 15 flush mounted. You've got your digital ignition, multi-purpose gauges right here with tachometer, trim, and fuel. And then over there on the speedometer gauge, you actually have NEMA 2000 digital gauge in there too. So engine information like uh, PSI, your uh, engine temperature, hours, all that will be on that gauge there. And then this one right here, this boat's equipped with an Atlas hydraulic jack plate and that's your jack plate. Uh, gauge right there. Tri dual trim levers for that reason. Trimming of the engine. And then uh, here on the left side, you've got the jack plate raising up. Beautiful stitched leather wheel. You've got all your buttons down here, all your switches for your live wells, <clears throat> all your accessories right there. 
Moving toward the back of the boat here, you're going to notice one thing that's really different on the Vexus is both your captain and co-captain's chairs are riding on air ride seats. So extremely comfortable riding boat to begin with, but with the addition of air wave seats, it's really going to smooth out the ride, especially for that bigger water or really heavy traffic water. Here in the middle, you're going to have your built-in cooler. You have a dry side over here for your sandwiches and snacks, uh, obviously ice side over here for your drinks, all insulated, really nice to have right there. Here on the back deck, you're going to have the Vexus live well system. You have acrylic lids on both sides. This is the full uh, feature live well, so you have the intensive care feature. So you can fill the water all the way up here to the top. And then when you close that up, your fish aren't sloshing or moving around or anything like that. They just stay suspended so they don't get beat up back to weigh in. Two big storage lids here on the outside. And then the very last compartment back here is going to house your batteries. So you got 331 deep cycles for your trolling motor. You got 31 AGM over here for your cranking battery. That's all standard from Vexus. You got the battery shutoff switch right here. And then right there in the middle, we have the Minn Kota Precision 4-Bank Charger. That's going to do lithiums, AGMs, floods. They can do all those different charging systems there. And then this boat, of course, is powered by the Mercury 250 V8 Pro XS and has two 8-foot rafters. That's it for our walk around of the 2023 Vexus VX21. Stop in here to Taylor South Shore Marina. We're a mile down the road from Caesars Creek Lake right here in Waynesville, Ohio. And check out Vexus and see what they have to offer you. Thanks for watching.